My name is Josie Lanzi. I was super excited to hear about the Real Women of Philadelphia Season 3 and all the wonderful contests going on and opportunities. This week, it's all about the delicious dream to go to France. Some of you might know this and some of you might not. My first language is French. That's right, I was born in a little town outside Quebec, Canada. A household full of nothing but French speaking and nothing but French cooking. But believe it or not, I've never been to France before. So today, I am trying out for that chance to win that delicious dream to go to France. I'm going to use the new Philadelphia cooking creams today to create a fantastic dish named croquette de poisson. In English, it's fish croquette and we're going to top it with this wonderful savory lemon and herb sauce. It's going to be super easy, take no time, and it's going to be absolutely fantastic. So let me show you how it's done. Okay, in this bowl I have two and a half cups of shredded cooked fish. I'm going to add a quarter cup of red bell pepper, finely chopped, and two green onions, also finely chopped. All we need to add is the Philadelphia cooking cream. We're going to add five ounces of the cooking cream and save the remainder five ounces for the creamy sauce that we're going to serve our croquette with. It's going to be fantastic. Not only the cooking cream is packed with all the fresh herbs that you would normally need for this recipe and all of the flavors of the lemon to go with this perfect fish. It also helps hold everything together. Okay, cover your mixture really well with a plastic wrap. If we're setting this in the fridge for 30 minutes, it will help harden the mixture so it'll be easier to form the croquettes right before we get ready to cook them. So let's head to the fridge. Okay, our mixture has been in the refrigerator for 30 minutes, so it's perfectly nice and stiff now so we can go ahead and create our croquettes. I have here some beaten eggs for an egg wash and also have some Italian breadcrumbs here. That's what I'm using today for the breading. So let's start making some croquettes. To form the croquettes, I'm using today a medium-sized cookie scoop. So you want to scoop two scoop of it in your hand, just like so. And what you want to do is create about a four inch long, one inch thick croquettes, just like so. Next, you want to take your croquette and you want to roll it in the breadcrumbs. In the egg mixture and back in the breadcrumbs. You want to do this until you run out of the mixture. A chance to get to France finally would be fabulous. I'm sure once I'm there I will totally fall in love. But we got some croquette to finish so let's head to the stove and cook him up. All right, I have half an inch of oil already that's been preheated. It's now time to add our croquettes. So you want to cook these for four minutes on the first side. Then you're going to turn them and cook them an additional three to four minutes. You want them just golden brown all the way around. All right, while your croquettes are cooking, we're going to do our sauce. You want to put the remaining five ounces of the Philadelphia cooking cream. This is the savory lemon and herb. It's perfect for the fish croquettes. You want to add a quarter cup of dry white wine. You're going to whisk this together. Thanks to the Kraft's new Philadelphia cooking cream. Sauce has never been so easy. Remove croquettes and place on a paper towel to drain. And voila, you have fabulous fish croquettes here. I hope you enjoy my fabulous croquette de poisson. Thank you, Kraft, for your wonderful product. You really tied this one in together. Really felt like I was in France today. My name is Josie Lanzi. Thank you for watching. For now, I leave you with bon appétit and au revoir.